Your star of the show, what are you talking about? Yeah, Kristoff. The star of the show, he knows it now. Oh, shut up. <laughs> He's like, oh, no, don't say that. <laughs> no, the pressure's on, right? All right. Well, I haven't recorded much lately because we're just putting it back together. The truck's running, antifreeze is backing in and stuff like that. Yeah. But we've decided to take a little detour on this project right. and I will take you behind our magical curtain. Behind the scenes. <laughs> this is... <laughs> <laughs> we are painting the doors and the hood. It's already been primed. Ferdy went through and rebondoed this thing because um, uh, before we bought the truck, it got rolled on the passenger side, so it crunkled, it crumpled the whole like passenger side of the truck, and we've left it for like the last 10 years. Yeah, 10, 13 years that we've owned it. And since we have the hood off already and the, everything, I pulled the doors off too, and we're gonna paint it. We already primed it. Uh, so now we're getting ready to paint it. Got some look at this, look at this pretty paint in here. So yeah, I'll grab some flashlight. One second. So it's the exact same paint code that uh, was used before, so we're gonna let it rip. Yeah. Alex will not let us give it flare. Yeah, we wanted to put a nice white uh, secondary coat on the side, uh, but she didn't want none of that, so we're just going with the blue. Yeah, she's gonna be a straight blue. That's all she's letting us do. It's her truck, so we can't argue too much. Cause we have a Two, uh, three different paint guns, a little one, a big one, and then this medium one. We bought a kit. He's testing uh, to make sure everything's set up right. We have a air dryer filter plumbed into the air hose with a pressure pressure reducer. So it's only run, it's set to 40. It drops to like 35 when he's using it. We found that works good for us. I guess everyone's different. I think it's all set up. Yep. All right. He's got a respirator on. I'm gonna get out of here and put a second one on, and then I'll show you a little bit of the painting. We put this plastic up so that the dust wouldn't get on the Big M and all the other stuff. We tarped those too. And this is keeping this corner a lot warmer because we got heat ducts right there. So I'm gonna put this on and I'll just show you what he's doing. I am obviously not a professional. So. Pretty good. Does it look good, mate? Yeah. Uh, I can't complain. Now we are not professionals. Yeah. And this is actually like the first time we've ever used this paint gun. And um, we we understand there's probably some things we're doing wrong to like the professional eye, but we're farmers. But this is gonna be a farm truck, so for us it actually looks pretty nice, we think, and we're happy with how it comes out. Yeah. Alright, how it's coming out. Um, Already just filled up again. A little filling contraption we got going there. But we got one gun. That's for primer. This is touch up. We actually just got this kit because our old one was junk. We haven't used it in like six years. So. This one is prime. He's gonna he's gonna start on the hood now because we just got done the doors. I wish I had a little better fit up so I can reach further. We'll see, see how she goes. Make sure I don't hit the the door.
You're really right reaching. What? You're really reaching. I am reaching that. Ooh. He's uh, mixing it right now. The little mix it cups. They know what ratio of uh, reducer to put in. I just hold this for him. We don't have a holder, so that's what I'm doing. Two to one. So two parts paint, one part reducer. Okay. Filter. Make sure there's no particles in there. Well, Ferdy got done painting and he clear coated it already. Yeah. And I mean, I don't think it's gonna get much more reflective than that. Doors are done. I think they came out pretty good for being a farm truck. Not bad for a farm truck. I mean, we gotta put the emblems back on. That go right there. But. I don't think it's half bad. I mean, we could have done a little, a couple stuff a little different. We know that, but for the first paint job in a long time, it's pretty decent. Now, we just gotta finish assembling that truck and because we did this we've already realized that um, this is gonna throw off the color of the truck because that's so glossy so now the next project is because it looked like dog crap we're gonna now pull all the exhausts off the air breathers off and the tanks and that's all gonna get painted too now I don't even see a fucking camera get it out here Anyways, it's the next day. <laughs> it smells in here, but I'm like, you can't hear me with the respirator on. Um, we pulled the truck in, and we sanded the, uh, not sanded, we wire grinded the frame this morning outside, and we sanded the cab too, and that's already been primed, and a little bit of it's already painted. But because we didn't want to, we had to do it in here because we got to keep it over 70 degrees, which sucks because the shop is hot, and it sucks working in here right now. But we had to build this little, we had to build this little room right here and we pretty much sealed it up and that's where the cap, the hood is and the two doors right now. That way none of this dust or anything gets on it. Even though it's dry, we don't wanna risk getting that little bit of uh, dust stuff on it or anything else on it. We're, so we sealed that up and put in a little room right there. And then um, Ferdy is just cleaning up the primer one because I had to get some towels so we can finish cleaning it. He's already painted blue with the other gun because it's two different guns. And we can go in here and we'll show you how that's looking. He's got to fill it up or he already did. He already filled it up with the next set. All right. Oh, it stinks in here. Close this up. So he's already sprayed a lot of that. We tarped everything. This right here is the part that goes between the window and the cab. Oh. And he hasn't painted this side yet. These right here go behind the air breathers. Right here, we even took those off. We're trying to do all the stuff we can. He's already painted the blue on the back. Cause this used to have a sleeper that was removed so we could fit sliding kit on. I tell you, I saw on YouTube to make this X, 
right here big, for like big window spots works really good it doesn't let it move back and forth a lot so more youtube learning right there but i'm gonna put this on because he's painting and i'll show you over there we're even doing the top of the cab and that's actually the main reason we're doing this because the top was so sun faded it actually cracked all the paint off and it was down to steel so that's the main reason we're doing the cab is because of the roof because we don't want it to rust out It's getting so dusty in here, the lighting is changing. Uh -huh. There's also not a lot of lighting. Yeah, we got two lights, that's all we got. Oh, oh truck looks good. It's a lot better than I did. With the whole crew here, well, we gotta clean them. Man, we got a barrel out. here to help us uh, hold the, the front. We got this side on. We got two bolts in. We gotta put all the cables on. But you know, it is what it is. We're getting there slowly. We still got two put air breathers on. Stuff, but we wanted to get the hood on. We got a JC and Luke come to help put it because it's kinda heavy. Oh it's not cool if you can see. That's the <laughs> not cool when you see. Hurry's getting these last bolts in on this side. We got the hood on and Philip and Stan were painting the frame today. That's also done. So that is looking shinier. I started polishing some of the stainless right there. This sucker needs the air breathers and exhaust on, but I gotta polish those first. I got the visor cleaned and we got the front stuff to put on, like all the guards around the headlights, but all of it's gotta be shined up a little bit. But that ain't bad. We gotta do the rims. We're gonna get there. It's a hell of a heck of a project, though. Yeah, let's go. It's coming. That'll be it for this video. Uh, that's pretty much painting it. So don't forget to like and subscribe to see more of this.